Hey, good morning. Welcome to Mary's Horse Prepping. I'm your host, Greg. What a beautiful sunrise here in Growing Zone 6A in Ohio. Grateful to see it. I want to propose a hypothetical, a theory, and due to the censorship, that's all this is. It's a theory, a hypothetical. But if I were truly an evil person or a corporation in the background, how would I control the world? And this is all hypothetical, but if I were wanting to take control over the world, I could do it within three months. And how would I do that? First off, in theory, I would create a virus that had consequences in theory. But before that was unleashed, I had broadcast it three months and, it, and label it event 201 in theory. And if said pandemic were to escape, I would be the one to have a pre-tested vaccine ready to administer to the population. And said pandemic, I would be able to control the scenario if I was truly an evil person or corporation or a group of people because people are naturally greedy. They want money. They want power. They're willing to sacrifice themselves for the above. So in theory, I would say here, this is the pandemic that is spreading across our world. Here is a vaccine that I've already have in storage and I'm making more. Here in theory, I don't want you to allow through censorship, talking about alternative medicines or drugs or anything else. We don't want that. And if you don't censor, censor that talk, in theory, that your stock shares are going to tumble. And since I'm a major shareholder in virtually all social media as a conglomerate, you don't want that to happen, in theory. So the pandemic is accidentally released upon the population, in theory, and people are dying in... in Unheard of numbers. That's a fact. But in theory, I am allowing my vaccines to be administered as a life-saving drug, allowing my group of people behind the scenes and my corporation, in theory, to make billions of dollars in the first quarter alone, double digit profits in theory for this hypothetical virus, if I was truly an evil person. And if I can't control you through your workplace by having you fired or having your work censured because I'm a shareholder in the mega corporations of healthcare and because I supply in theory, medicines used to save lives, you're not going to allow experimental alternatives in theory. If I was truly an evil person, my mouthpieces who I am funding their campaigns around the world with generous donations, lavish gifts, they would do my bidding and express my talking points to the people who vote for them. And for the people that aren't elected, in theory, they're not afraid to not tell the complete truth because they know, in theory, there will be no retaliation against the people because they're just a bureaucrat with no accountability. If I was truly an evil person, that would be the route I would take. Not only through controlling the World Health Organizations that administer drugs and propaganda and talking points in theory because I would be donating them with lavish gifts and money in theory. But these are just some of the things to talk about. 
And then, and then when the population starts to rebel, in theory, hypothetically, the leader of said country would say, we have bigger guns than you. Your AR-15s are no match for our government because we have F-16s. And that has been said twice as a direct threat to the population who is questioning their authority and how I control the scenario around the world in theory. This has just been something to think about because you ask yourself, why is the World Economic Forum promoting, advocating complete and total censorship in the European Union with threats of fines, shutting down, blocking social medias that don't agree with my theory, hypothetically? Why now all the mass censorship? because they're talking about a new pandemic called Gen X that has a 100% kill rate in laboratory mice within eight days. And this is the new pandemic in theory that is potentially about to be released upon the world in theory, but nothing to be afraid of there because in theory, I have your back if I were truly an evil person. You think about that. And in theory, you have to have a digital passport with all your health records encoded on that. You can't buy, sell, or travel unless you have my hypothetical vaccine to Gen X. You think about that. In theory. Does this sound like something out of the book of Revelation, the time of sorrows that Jesus Christ represented us, told us, and said, warned us about? In the end times, there will be lawlessness, falling away, cold hearts, not following the scripture, lover of themselves, greed. All the things that are happening right now, wars and rumors of wars, plagues, and all that kind of stuff. But in theory, you're not seeing me because I am a corporation with no face but very deep pockets. Now's the time you get yourself right with God. You repent of your sins. You ask for forgiveness. You change your life. Repent each and every day because you sin each and every day. Get baptized, submerged in water, born again in the name of Jesus Christ only. Change your life because in theory, I don't exist. Greg out.